Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a boohoo and misguided combined haul. So if you like the sound of that video then stay tuned and make sure that you hit that subscribe button before you go anywhere and let's just jump straight into the video. Okay guys, so I'm going to start off with the things that I purchased from boohoo.com. Boohoo is literally one of my all time favourite websites and I do buy so much stuff from there. So I'm going to start off with this first piece. This is just a khaki bomber jacket. And I think this is from the Petite range. So this is what the jacket looks like. Uh, it just has the black trim round the top and round the bottom and the cuffs as well. And it has a little zip detail on the sleeve which opens up and you can see your arm through that. This is super, super lightweight. It almost feels like some sort of foam material. I'm not entirely sure what that's called. Um, but it was super, super affordable. This was only £6 and I think I did pick it up in a sale... Um, I want to say that it was reduced, so for £6, just to throw on top of a t-shirt and a pair of jeans, I literally don't think you can go wrong with that. Okay guys, so my next item from Boohoo.com is this small cropped vest. This still has the label on because I haven't worn it yet. Um, so this is just a black and white t-shirt. It's had the sleeves cut so that they sort of hang off the sides of your arms. I love this sort of style t-shirt at the moment. I'm obsessed with it. So this top on the front just has this sort of motif, um, it's got a little snake and a skull. I just thought that this was really sort of rock chick-esque. Um, I was planning on wearing this for a night out that we were gonna go on with a skirt that I also purchased from Boohoo. But we actually never ended up going on the night out, so this is still an outfit that's in my wardrobe ready to wear. I want to say this t-shirt was about 10 pounds as well, so it wasn't really that, wasn't really that um, expensive. And I do feel like this can be worn loads of ways. I'm planning on wearing this with a black sort of wet look, uh, high-waisted skirt. This could also just be thrown on with a pair of black jeans or a pair of any colour jeans, to be honest. Uh, maybe a denim skirt if you want to keep it more casual or even a pair of leggings. However, because it's cropped, it would be far too short for me to wear with a pair of leggings because you'd be able to see my bum. So, yeah. Unless you put a vest top underneath it. If you had a vest top on, that would obviously be a good option. So I love this. Can't wait to wear it. Okie dokie, next item that I picked up from Boohoo is the skirt that, as I say, I was planning on wearing with that t-shirt. So this is just a wet look, almost PVC wet look skirt. I am obsessed with leather and wet look sort of looking material. I just thought this was really rock chick and it's high waisted so this would look perfect with that little black crop top and also a pair of black shoes which I will come to in a minute. Um, this one, again, really affordable. This was probably about £8. This obviously still has the labelling because I haven't worn it yet. Um, super shiny, wet look mini skirt, it says. It is high, it, on myself, it is high waisted. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that. But yeah, I absolutely love the skirt. I literally can't wait to wear it. I just need to organise somewhere to go so that I can actually put it on. Okay, guys, so moving on to misguided. I am obsessed with Misguided. Because the things on Misguided are slightly more expensive than the things on Boohoo, I tend not to buy that much from Misguided. And when I do buy something, it's normally something that I've been wanting for ages or it's something that I know I'm going to get loads of wear out of. So the next three items are my Misguided items. And I'm going to start off with this t-shirt dress. Now, this is a t-shirt dress that's sort of been cut around the top, so it's almost like a halter neck. And again, the sleeves on this are cut so that they hang off the sides of your arms. This is in a size 10 and it's abs it looks absolutely massive. So, it has this motif on the front, again, another skull, and it says, we are the future exodus. And I just thought this would be fab for casual, any sort of day wear with a black leather jacket or wearing on a night out. I have already worn this on a night out with one of the belts that I'm gonna show you in a second. Um, with this sort of cinched in around the waist with a belt and it obviously pulls up the length of the dress, so when you've got it on, it's a lot shorter than it looks here, because I'm aware that this looks massive. So this is literally probably one of my favourite items at the minute. I will wear this with black tights and a pair of trainers and my black leather jacket, or I'll wear it just with bare legs and a pair of heels for a night out. I just, I'm really into the sort of rock chick vibe at the minute, so I've got quite a lot of things like that in my wardrobe. Okay, so next item, <clears throat> excuse me, is the belt that I was literally just talking about then that I wore with this t-shirt. So this is a regular black belt that I picked up. I actually picked this one up in Primark. So this is kind of a cheat. The plan originally was that I was going to pick one of these up from Misguided and it was basically the exact same belt. However, that one was about £15 and when I was in Primark, I saw this, this was £3. So 
Makes sense to get the Primark one. So this can be worn as a normal belt around your waist or it can be worn as a high-waisted belt up here. So I usually have this hanging from my hips with the black, um, with the grey t-shirt, sorry, from Misguided and it just gives more of a rock chick feel. So I absolutely love this belt. This would also be really good with a black pair of high-waisted jeans as well. I do have a couple of pairs of black high-waisted jeans so I am excited to try wearing this with them and see what kind of looks I can create with those. Okay, moving on to my favourite part, shoes. So I picked up two pairs of shoes from Misguided and the first pair are these pumps. I have been wearing these to death since I got them. So yes, they are probably a little bit marked and probably do need to wipe down with a cloth, but these are so comfy. So these pumps have a slight wedge on the sole underneath, as you can see, and the front is just this beautiful ruffle now I have a very, very different taste, I would say, to a lot of my friends and none of my friends like these shoes, so every time I wear them I do get the mix taken out of me. It doesn't stop me from wearing them though. You, I've never seen anybody else wearing a pair of shoes like this and I am obsessed. These look amazing, again with that t-shirt dress. These also look really, really nice with black um, leather look trousers and sort of like a little cropped vest or something. Um, these are sort of faux leather if you like and the ruffles are attached to the front of them so they don't come off but they're just so comfy and they give me say an extra inch of height as well because I am really short so these give me a little bit of height thanks to the wedge on the sole and I just absolutely love them. These were I want to say around £30 and these are still available on the Misguided website. These also come in black so I might end up treating myself to a black pair we will have to see. Okay, so the last item from Misguided. These bad boys are still in the box because I haven't actually had a chance to wear them yet. So, these are just a pair of black suede sort of feel stiletto shoes. And back in the day, I used to wear so many stilettos. I just found them the comfiest heels for myself. So, I picked up these. These, as I say, are black sort of suede stilettos. And they have this crisscross on the front which looks like this so once you've got your foot inside the material shows off parts of your skin and your leg and your foot the heel height on these is probably about four and a half to five inches something like that they are quite high and I got these in a size smaller than I would normally get because the fives were too big and the fours just seem to fit a little bit better so I am super excited to wear these these are probably one of the most comfiest pairs of heels that I found in a long time. When I did this haul originally, I did order so many pairs of shoes. I think I had about six or seven pairs of shoes that came. And I just couldn't walk in them. I think it's because I'm not used to wearing heels because obviously I was pregnant and then the last year I've been running around after Lucas. So I just don't have time to wear heels. Trainers, pumps, sandals, flat boots, things like that are just so much more practical for me. But at the same time, on a night out, you obviously need to get your glam on. So these are gonna be perfect for a night out. My original thought was that I would wear these with the black wet look skirt and the black crop top from Boohoo. Um, I just obviously haven't actually gotten around to wearing them yet. So these I want to say were around £30, uh, which I think is super, super amazing for such a nice pair of shoes. The misguided shoes as well, in my opinion, do seem to last quite a long time. I've had a few pairs from Boohoo that haven't sort of lasted the distance, if you like, whereas I do feel like the misguided shoes are fantastic quality. So they are definitely down on my list of things to wear. And that is everything in my Boohoo and Misguided haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button below. If you have any of these items yourself, leave me a comment in the comments box and let me know. And if there are any, if you guys know of any shoes similar to these pumps, maybe in a slightly different colour, give me a shout in the comments and let me know because I am obsessed with these and I could definitely do with having a few pairs of them just in case. Maybe different colours though. I would be really interested to see if anybody could find a khaki pair because I'm really, really into khaki at the moment, so that would make me super happy. So yeah, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button and I will see you guys in my next video.